Hello guys, welcome back to Minecraft on the Block. This is um, Feed the Beast, FTB Craft, Feed the Beast server. And it's a tutorial series on how to get started and a server that we can play together on, a server you guys can join. And uh, it'll be it'll be awesome. Um, I'm looking forward to it. So, um, we're going to continue on. Last time we were getting ready to try to make a mass raider, and I remembered that you got to have a lot of stuff on this server because we're playing on hard. So the, uh, the, let's see, the recipes for things like a macerator are considerably different. Macerator requires um, diamonds and flint and a machine block, and then this, which is, let's see, advanced circuit, which then requires some glowstone. And we got a lot of stuff we got to go to the nether for. So we're going to make another run. I got my nether kit on. I got my cobblestone and gravel, some food, my flint. I got a, enough to make another nether portal if I get in trouble. Some coal, uh, you know, various stuff. I am going to take my diamond pick, so let's just show you what I got. I found some diamonds. I got seven, plus I had the three there, so I had ten total. Um, I have... Quite a bit of ore from all my mining. I started getting, you know, a decent amount of, of stuff going and I had to upgrade my chest and stuff. So we're we're doing pretty good now. We're getting we're getting there. So we got, you know, we got a couple of machines. We had our generator and our extractor. We got ready to make our macerator and we can't do it yet. So oh that's right. The other thing was an advanced machine block, wasn't it? No, it's just a machine block, so. Um, or we can make a sturdy casing, which I think you have to make on like a no, it's just safe crafting. So we could we could do that too. So anyway, but we're good. And we're going to head out. I hate the nether, and I figured I'm going to take a, a diamond pickaxe in case I find some iridium, because I think that's probably worth doing. We might do a little mining there. Um, I think i got enough food. I brought the mushrooms in the bowl just in case, and a little bit of bread. And if we can't get back with this, I'm just going to die. And all of this is what I'm willing to sacrifice if I, <laughs> if I have to. i got some iron and whatnot. So let's get going. There we go. And I'm sure we're just going to link up to the same portal as everybody else. But, we'll see. So. Oh. Well, that was awfully kind. Oh. Goodness gracious, that was so close. <laughs> um. Oh. Nice. So, that was really... I mean, so now we can get a lot of stuff that we need. We need this uh, nether brick. I can't believe I almost just died. This is excellent. This is really excellent. That was a really, really, really pleasant surprise. Really pleasant. Alright. So you guys know how this goes. I make horrible videos in the nether, so you're just going to have to Bear with me um, as I make a horrible video, and we'll go over here and try to get some some stuff. It seems like really interesting, really, really interesting. Everybody has taken the soul sand from here. Man, those things are scaring me. <laughs> Hanging down like that. Uh, we're going to need blaze rods. We're going to need a lot of stuff. This is good, though. So, we need a good chunk of this, uh, you know what I didn't do? Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, I hear you. We need a good chunk of this stuff. Wow, this is pretty cool. This is a good fortress. So, somebody, somebody was nice enough to link us up with the fortress. And... Just really, really happy about that. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Okay, so let me uh, just get some of this stuff. I don't know exactly what the protocol is here. It seems like it's kind of free, and it certainly hasn't been like super overpicked through. So that's good. It's a little dangerous. I don't see any glowstone, so we'll probably have that to deal with. But and I also really like these. It seems like people just aren't here for what I'm here for. <laughs> Usually so. Anyway, let me let me do this. I'm just gonna do a little mining in here, and if I find interesting stuff, I'll come back. Hey guys, I'm back. I dug straight through the mountain Oop. over there, and 
and uh, got over here and found... I forgot to bring a... I forgot to bring a uh, bow. Which seems like something I could have probably used. Let's see. Because I really need to get that... Uh, let's see if I can time this just right. Kind of seems stuck or something, doesn't he? Hmm. Anyway, so I found some, uh, <laughs> I found some glowstone. So, actually, quite a bit. It's really not that bad here. This is the, I, I have to say, the best nether I think I've ever been to. Now, I could die. But, so far, best another ever. And I'm still not making a very good video, so it's... I did realize that once I get out of here, I'm going to have to uh, walk a long way, because it's not going to take me a portal to my house, of course, but that's all right. Now let's see. What is the best way to go about this? I like to get this right here, though. I like to, but it's above the lava, so I'm gonna have to. That's alright, we'll just do it. We got time. Oh, wait, what about that right there? Oh, no. Seriously? Am I going to be on fire and die? Oh my goodness. Holy cow. <laughs> what an idiot. It seemed like the lava was flowing a weird direction. Okay, that scared me. Wow. Well, this is excellent. This could not be better, my friends. All right. So what we're going to do, we could use some blaze rods for sure. Um, but I think what we're going to do is we're going to get as much of this as we can get. This is really what we came here for. Once we get this, we can basically make our macerator, so we're not in really bad shape. Um, so I think I'm going to try to go get that other glowstone. I'm feeling a little bit bold. That was exactly 64 pieces. That seems unlikely, but, but yeah, I want some, uh, I'm gonna have to tool around that, that place and try to find, try to find some, uh, the word I'm looking for is try to find some blaze, but you know, this has just created a mess for me. So let's, I feel like I'm pushing my luck, but Especially since we don't really know where that ghast is. That's right, we'll just create ourselves a nice little platform here. Absolute worst nether gamer video maker in the whole world. I hate it. Uh, for you guys that know. And I know you hate probably hearing me say it a hundred times, but I can't get over how much I hate it. It looks like somebody's been here, close by, and didn't pick all this dry, so I think... Hmm. That guy's gonna cause me problems. Go away 
for just a minute. Let me just finish my work here. That was dangerous. Extremely. Let's just get a little bit of this. And I gotta drop some stuff to do that. I think he's above this thing, so we're okay. I know I'm not even talking. See, this is exactly how it goes. I guess we can just always come back if we need to, but man. <laughs> I just don't want to. But if I die, I'm gonna have to. At least we would know where to go to get ourselves some. All right, he's close again. I get so disoriented looking up, getting up. There we go. All right, we're good. I'm sick of it. All right, let's go this way. Sorry. Okay, I'm better. Now, what we need... A couple of things. Let's see, can I get back where I came from from over here? I think I can... Or close. Woo. Not really, but let's see. Let's go down this way. I can just dig through the mountain if I need to, but I got a nice little tunnel already if I could find it without dying. I think it's right down here. <laughs> Uh, worst ever. Oh, nice. Let's just see if we can get any. No? Nothing. Okay, there's our tunnel. And a ghast is on our tail. There we go. Okay. Heading back. Now, this is a long tunnel. Let me, uh, let me do this. Actually, I will... I got some soul sand already. I got a little bit of nether brick. Where's my nether brick? Right there. I need quite a bit more of that. Got a good amount of soul sand. You can turn nether rack into nether brick in a compressor, I think it is. Nine of them or something in a compressor, but I just want to get enough. Um, the thing I'm going to be missing is I need... Well, I don't know. I may come back. I may take a trip home, get rid of my stuff, and then come back. We'll see. So let me let me get back to the gate, and I'll catch up with you. Hey, guys, I'm back. <clears throat> Apparently, after talking to some people, there's no uh, there's no blaze spawner here in the Nether Fortress at the uh, default spawn portal fortress. So they'll spawn naturally, though. And I found one already. And so I decided I'm going to create a... place to come up here and try to get them to spawn. I hope they'll spawn up here. I don't know why they wouldn't, but maybe they won't. I don't know. Anyway, close to the spawner or close to the portal be a nice way to get some, get some blaze. I found one, but didn't get any blaze rods. So really that's the other thing that we do need is some blaze blaze rods we're gonna need that to make we got to get steel steel's the big deal for me right now it's the thing that i always struggle getting to just because it requires uh it requires the the blaze rods and slime which i think also probably will be somewhat of a challenge I just don't know what to do. So few spawns in general. It's almost like, I don't know. There's got to be something going on with that. There's just a very few spawns. So anyway, we can come back. I think that's probably the right answer. We don't need to stay here and dink around getting uh, getting blaze. Very, very interesting, this, <laughs> this area. What's up here? Nothing. No spawners, no nothing. So it's going to be an interesting, it's going to be an interesting go of it. 
I guess we could just like hang out here, but I have to have so many of them because you, so you have to have the magma cream to make, uh, you have to have magma cream to make steel a blast furnace and a blast furnace is ultimately when it comes right down to it, ultimately what we're trying to get to. So I'm going to have to get that. Anyway, it's time to get out of the nether. This is lame and we need to get back and make a macerator and I'm still making crappy nether videos. So I'll talk to you guys in just a minute. I just realized I should probably show you guys where we end up when we go back home. I think it's the spawn or, or the, the spawn, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Where are we at? We are at Y16. Where is home? Home's only a thousand blocks that way. And how the heck do you get out of here? <laughs> this will be interesting. Nice green water, I like that. Let's see. I don't know if that was even English right there, but let's see if anybody can help me. that did that just get dark or was it me oh hmm got to be a way out of here let me see if I can find it I'll be back because <laughs> I came back and my little uh, spawning pads got a ton of dudes but no blaze I came back because I actually realized somebody had put... That's just a horrible place to try to get out of the nether. At. Ooh, there's one right there. Let's go get him. This could be our death, but that's okay. Just... Just... Come here. Yeah, don't fall off. The Did he? He did not, but... Oh man, that's so dangerous. He needs to get over here and he won't. And I won't be able to get him from down there. Let's see if I can coax him up. There we go. Over here. It's funny, they're just... They're kind of rare. And they're so necessary. And they just spawn so rarely. Come here. Yeah, come here. Do we get one? Yes, yes. Yes. What would we like to get rid of? Man, I don't really want to get rid of anything, frankly. Seriously, bones, I guess even though those are somewhat valuable because mobs are so rare. Let's see, what would we... Seriously, almost worth throwing away 10 for that, but I'm not going to throw away that axe. <laughs> That's okay. All right, let's see. Any other... Ooh, there's one down there. And that dude. We need one of those. If we could get a... Uh... 
This is crazy. It's crazy because... Yeah, come here. Yeah, you, come here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's two of them. Nice, this is good. I just don't want to fall off. That scared me. Somebody's playing with some toys down here that's making... No, I actually don't even think anybody is... Can you guys get up here? A little help? I would really like those guys to come over here. It's dangerous though to be running around. Ouch. Let's see. I don't, it just went off. It started making noise. I thought it was you. That's hilarious. My wife came down and she's like, what's going on with these toys? Are right, you guys seriously come up here? Get up here. No, not you. This is as good as anything. Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill these guys in a minute. I'll be back. I guess I got one of them to come over, and I got another blaze rod. But I gotta get a bow. I can't mess around with this without a bow. I'm gonna get killed. So, I'll go see if we can find this other portal. That was my original plan, anyway. Maybe we'll find another blaze on the way over there. Although I doubt it. So the other one was, if I remember correctly, I thought it was like right over here or something. Let's see. Hmm. That's the one I came in through. I was pretty sure there was one fairly close. Let me see if I can find it. Okay, found another one right there. I killed three wither skeletons. Nothing. No wither thingies. I also killed one of those, like, bouncing slime things, which I can never remember the name of. Um... And I didn't get any of the stuff I was looking for. But there's a portal up there. That's the one I was looking for. I'm hoping it's going to take me even closer to my home. That would be pretty cool, <laughs> actually. there's I know there's like... Sarkaz is always talking about the math that you can do to link portals and stuff. i got to figure that out. But anyway, this is what we're going to do. I'm already 22 minutes in. This is... See, I just got to get past the nether episode. I'm going to post this the same day with another one just so people don't think I suck that bad. Okay, so... Am I in somebody's town? I feel like I'm in somebody's town. And it's a pretty cool town. I'll give them that. I like it. So where am I at? I'm not that far from home, am I? Oh, yeah, I am. I'm even farther from home. But, you know what? I like a nice walk. Question is, can I get out of here? Mm, the answer might be no. There we go. There we go. All right. So it's really now a matter of getting home without dying that's what it is <laughs> if i get up without dying i'm in good shape so i'm gonna make the run uh see where we get and hopefully if i get far enough along let's make sure we got spawn death point is enabled just in case if we can get back in time without dying i'm gonna make a macerator and we're gonna call it a video <laughs> all right guys thanks for sticking with me i'll be back all right guys we're back made it here didn't die put all my stuff away in the chest here we're doing pretty good. So, also stopped along the way. Actually, I was going to show you. This was a really good trip. Got some red cobblestone, two stacks. So we'll be using that quite a bit, and I'm going to need to go get more. I should have actually made a note of where that place was now that I think about it. But what I'll probably do is make another nether run, <clears throat> get some uh, blaze rods, 
come back on the way back, pick up a bunch of cobblestone. So anyway, not a big deal. It'll be perfect. So now that we're kind of getting set, we definitely need the blaze rods. If we can get blaze rods and um, blaze rods and slime balls, we will really, really be in good shape. Um, that'll that'll be really good. So, and I know there's a swamp right over there. I'm gonna have to go check that out. Anyway, I haven't seen any slime balls or slimes though. So we need a couple of these, a couple of these, and I think like four of these. And we're gonna turn this into an advanced circuit. Let's see. I always wait for this thing to cycle through, but yeah, there we go. I think I got it wrong. Yeah, I got it wrong. <laughs> Let's see if we can figure this out. Uh, we need two more of these. So, one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, circuit, advanced circuit. And then three diamonds, four flint. I think we got all that, so let's see. Four flint, three diamonds, and Now we have a mass raider. Now we have a mass raider. So what we're going to do, bam, we need an electric wrench. We're not going to mess around because the mass raider is expensive and we don't want to mess around with our, there it is. So we need an electronic circuit, a battery, and a wrench. And we don't want to mess around with our uh, mass raider possibly getting lost once we put it down and then have to move it. And I just don't like to have to worry about that. So actually what I might do is stop here since we got, we got the master reader, we got through the nether. You guys have seen that it's possible. This was, if, if I were you, I would have watched this episode and I'd have been like, Oh, whew, it's not that hard. I'm going to go to the nether. I'm going to get my stuff because that's, that's how I would be feeling. But, um, the other option just kind of throw it out there is that you could, you could run a, a long way in some direction. Um, I don't know how far you have to go to get away from the spawn portal so that you don't get linked, but you'd have to go quite a ways. If you did that, you could go and you could put a portal down somewhere and get your totally, just get your own. Maybe, you know, work to getting a portal gun. What does that take? Do you have to go to the nether for a portal gun? I think you might. No, you don't. You just need an ender pearl and a diamond. If you get yourself a portal gun, then you could just run a long way, set a portal at your home base, run a really long way, put down your, your, uh, your portal, get all the crap you need. And in fact, we might do that. Well, I, I just would like to find a fortress that had a, um, had a blaze spawner and you'd have to go quite a ways in the nether to do that. I think, um, but maybe not, I don't know. We'll see. It may not be that big of a deal. So anyway, I think we're, I think we're good for this time. I think what I'll do is get prepared to make that wrench. What is that portal spawner? Um, I'll get prepared to make that wrench. And it's going to just require some bronze, which isn't a big deal. You just have to have some copper and tin. Oh, that's interesting. Copper and tin ingots make bronze ingots? I thought you had to have dust. Copper. Tin. Let's see. Maybe this will be easier than I thought it was. Really? Huh. That is not the way I understood that to work. I thought you had to have dust. Well, what do you know? So now we can make a wrench like so. And let's go ahead and do it then. Since we're here, let's make our battery. So I need some redstone and some tin. We don't have a lot of tin, but I think we might have enough for this. So batteries go like this. Just like so. So we've got ourselves a battery. And the only other thing we need now is an electronic circuit, which is six of those red sun and refined iron, which we've got. We have it nice. We totally got enough. So six of those, a couple of redstone and refined iron. And then we just put this in like so. And we got an electric wrench. Now, the next thing we're going to want to work on is a bat pack. And... 
we'll want to get to a, a lap lap pack eventually. But so this is one piece of tin and electric circuit. So this is a few batteries. I'm gonna to need to smelt down some. Uh, I'm gonna need to smelt down some tin to get that, and I don't want to do that yet because we don't have the macerator laid out. So we'll get the macerator out, and then we'll get a bat pack. It only holds sixty thousand um, EU, but that's enough to run a couple of our tools and allow us to, you know, have have the the wrench and maybe a I don't know chainsaw. Although I don't think we I think we need steel for all of that chainsaw. Yeah, we're gonna have steel for all of that. So we're gonna have to work on getting steel. That's really gonna be one of my next big things. I'm gonna have to get blaze rods. And I think we're just gonna have to go to the nether and grind it out. And so what I'll probably do is get prepared. Um, get prepared for that to go to the nether, get myself a couple of swords, do some more mining, maybe even get some diamond armor. Although I don't really, it's not that useful, but I definitely need to get a bow. Definitely need to get a bow and some arrows, which I should be able to do since I got all these chickens. Um, and I can definitely get more chickens. So I think we're sitting pretty. Um, get yourself to this point. Get yourself to the nether. And even if you don't get all the blaze rods, we still got a lot of stuff we can do without having to get steel. Um, steel really is is useful for getting like like the drill. I mean, I got to get, that's my probably my biggest thing is getting the diamond drill, um, which is this right here. So you got to have three diamonds, but that's not the biggest part. It's the steel. Um, and steel's not that bad. We also need a coke furnace. So just to kind of give you an idea, the blast furnace, um, blast furnace bricks require soul sand, nether brick, and magma cream. Magma cream, of course, cause, needs blaze powder and slime balls. Um, and I think you get three blaze powder per blaze rod. So we've got six of them. We can make six of these recipes if we had the slime balls for it. Or maybe you only get two. Probably only get two. You could probably, we probably could only make four. The thing is, we need get four of these per recipe. We need 38 of them, I believe, or 30, I think it's 38 of them, or 36, to make our blast furnace. So we gotta get that. The other thing we gotta do is we gotta get a coke furnace, um, so or coke oven, and that just is sand and bricks. That's not bad to create this thing. We just need to get some more sand and the bricks we got. So that's something we can find. That'll allow us to get the charcoal, which we can use, or a coke coal, a coal coke, I guess is what it's called, um, which we can use in the blast furnace to go one to one for iron to steel which is is much better so anyway again work on getting yourself to the point where you can uh where you can get to the nether um got to get your diamonds of course and get all that stuff done and then um, once you've done that once you got your diamonds and you're ready to go uh get get to the nether get your get your glowstone, get all that stuff. If you get some blaze, great. Um, if not, then we'll go back and we'll do it later. But we got some work to do before we have to have that anyway. So I keep rambling. Got the nether episode out of the way. I'm very happy to have done that. Thank you guys for watching. Thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, follow me on Twitter, Minecraft OTB. It's a great way to give me comments and let me know what you think. Um, also leave comments on the channel. I'll respond to all of them. Um, and yeah, have a good day, guys. Tell your friends and I'll talk to you next time.